Hey y'all, I'm Mandy, and this is Mandy in the Making. Today I'm going to bring you along in a day in the life. So I'm working, or I just finished working on the thumbnail for today's video. Um, well, I say today's video. It's already up. If you haven't seen it, I'll link it here. But tell you what, Pig Monkey, thank you for that right there. Just thank you. Okay, so I haven't fixed my hair yet. I do have on makeup, but I wanted to. I wanted to tell y'all I'm in my bathroom. Sorry. I'm in the bathroom and I'm getting ready and there's an animal I'm guessing under the house it sounded like it was in my cabinet not gonna lie I freaked out a little bit but it's not there's nothing in my cabinet um I'm guessing it's under the house but I hear it it's not the most comforting sound while you're getting ready anywho let me finish getting ready <laughs> All right, so now I'm in my car. I'm going to head out. I need to run a couple of errands today, but I'm also having lunch with a friend. So let's go. I have like 10 minutes before I'm supposed to meet my friend for lunch and we're meeting right like in the same shopping strip. There's a TJ Maxx right here. It is 11 something, 11 20. I guarantee you there's no Ray Dunn, but guess who's gonna go look? Shut up. I just was saying I want more baking dishes. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. All right y'all, so I just finished eating lunch with my friend. It was good to catch up. And now I'm gonna run to the grocery store. And I don't know, I'm, I might just, I'm not going to show y'all what I just saw because you don't want to see it. It just wasn't good. Anyway, moving on. Let's go to the grocery store. <laughs> was going to run to the grocery store, and I still am because I've got to get some stuff, but I never, ever go to Dollar General. Do y'all? Like, I always forget about it. I only think about the Dollar Tree, and then that's it. But I've heard a lot of YouTubers, and I've heard just a lot of people in general say, Dollar General is awesome, and all the ones around here have just recently been remodeled, and I'm at the one that um, everyone tells me to go check out, it, that it's the best one. So I had some extra time. I thought I would do that. Yes, I'm talking to a camera. Have a good day. This is why I'm awkward vlogging. Like, yep, there's people staring at me. Let's go into Dollar General. Why am I? I always the one to get this buggy. Everywhere I go. Anybody else feel me on that? They have a ton of Christmas already. And they have a lot of ornaments that are really cute that are only a dollar. So that's not a bad deal. Um, but I didn't necessarily come in here to look for Christmas. I just thought I would show y'all kind of what I was seeing. I never come into Dollar General, but check this out. Like, that's a mess. Let's go squeaking on through. They've got pretty cute lamps here. $15. Really cute, actually. That's not a bad price for lamps. Oh, those are eight, which is not bad. Those swell ones, do y'all know what I'm talking about? Are expensive, so eight bucks for that is not bad at all. Mm -hmm. 
So there was zero that I needed in Dollar General. And that buggy just got on my last nerve. I always choose that type of buggy. Every time. Never fails. But anyway, we are at the grocery store. We're going into Food Lion. And i got to grab a couple of things. I'll bring y'all along with me. Anybody else get excited to look at new cleaners? No? Just me? Okay. I thought I would bring y'all out here. Standing underneath the magnolia tree. It's like 65 degrees out here. And just gorgeous. I was born for this kind of weather. It could be like this all year round and I would be perfectly content. Awkward. The mail lady is here and probably wondering what in the world I'm doing. <laughs> so let's go get the mail. All right, while I was at the grocery store, I don't think I showed this. I picked up some Drano Max as well. My husband's, we have two um, sinks in our master bath. My husband's side was kind of stopped up, so just went back there and poured Drano in there, and I was going to show y'all what I picked up at TJ Maxx while I was there. I only got two things, one of which I'm sure you know, but um, because I showed it to you in the store. But I found another mug. Ray Dunn mugs are our favorite. They're simple, but it's mainly because of the size. They're so much bigger than regular mugs, and we love that. So we find ourselves reaching for them a lot. So I've been getting rid of a lot of our other mugs, and we're replacing them with Ray Dunn. But I found this one. They had one that said Wisdom, and I liked that one, but I really loved this one. It says Be Kind. So just another Ray Dunn mug. I think that's number five for us, maybe. I don't have a lot. I don't consider myself an avid collector, but I am always on the hunt for it, so I don't know. I think I have a small problem. Um, and the other thing that I picked up was a, another baking dish. And I had mentioned in my um, recent thrifting video, which I showed you this morning, I linked to it earlier, um, with Carrie from Carrie's Corner, that I've been on the hunt for more baking dishes that weren't just clear Pyrex. And I found this one, and I'm guessing it's like an 8x8. Eight eight. But they had two different kinds. They had this one that said More Please, and then they had another one that said Enjoy. But I picked this one up. It was $14.99, and it says it's good up to 400 degrees in the oven, so... I'm pretty excited about that. But that's all I picked up at TJ Maxx today. I was ready to be out of there perfectly on time, but then the line was kind of long. So I was a couple minutes late to meeting my friend for lunch, but we had a great lunch. We had a good time. Now I think I'm going to sit over here next to the big picture window in our living room and work on my puzzle. Fun fact about me, I love puzzles. My husband also said I, uh, says I love, um, what does he call them? Click, click games. Like Candy Crush and what's that other one I love so much? Farm Heroes Saga. And then I also play Mahjong. I think that's how you say it. I love those types of games. Anybody else love those types of games? Let me know in the comments below. But I love puzzles. And I got one for Christmas last year and I haven't put it together yet. And my mom recently picked up a new puzzle and was showing it to me, me and my sister, via text. And I was like, I need to pull out that puzzle. So it's a Clemson puzzle. Big shocker there, right? I'm going to show y'all how much I've gotten done already. Cole has helped a lot too, which has been nice. Here's the puzzle. Not the easiest puzzle in the world. Because I thought how I've always done puzzles is I've put together the outside first. But these pieces are all pretty much identical because it's all orange and purple. Um, so I got it together, or so I thought, and then realized because so many of the pieces were exactly alike, when I started actually trying to connect these pieces to... It didn't work. So I had to almost take this thing completely apart. Anyway, 
that's a lot of description about a puzzle. You probably don't care. But I've been working on it for a few days. I'm going to sit down and work on it a little bit more. Took me about, I don't know, 45 minutes or so to finish it up. That was a hard one. It was only 500 pieces, but it was pretty difficult. This is the hard part. I'm going to leave it sitting for a few days because it took so long to put together, but I'm not going to frame it or anything. I know a lot of people do, but I don't have a place to put it, so I'm not going to, but um, it hurts my heart to take it apart. So we're just... I'm just going to leave it sitting here on this card table for the next few days. <laughs> I just took my glasses off. I should probably wear my glasses all the time, quite honestly. But I'm sitting in the dining room right now. I had to come inside because I was on the phone and it was kind of loud outside. Let me show you who refuses to come inside. It's a little bright. <laughs> Princess Peach over there. Hang on. I'm going to show you. Hello, princess. What are you doing? Gracie Lou, it's time to go inside. And for anyone wondering, we do homeschool-ish. We do virtual school. Um, but my son is in eighth grade, so I don't have to sit with him all day, which is a blessing and a curse. Because... I'm not sitting there monitoring everything that he's doing. I'm giving him some room and some responsibility to do it on his own, but on, but um, sometimes he gets behind. But he is in his bedroom right now. He's supposed to be cleaning it. My husband told him to go clean his bedroom, so I hear him on the phone though. Pretty sure he's talking to his best friend, so I need to go check on that situation. And then pretty soon, I'm going to get started on dinner. It is 4.41, so I'm going to get started on dinner. And I won't be recording that on here. It will probably already be up on my channel. It's baked potato soup. Yum. If it is up, I'll link it here. If I put this one up first, you'll see it coming soon. I know. It feels great in the sun. I get it, girlfriend. But it's time to go inside. Come on. Grace. Grace, come on. I have to pick her up to take her in. Also, there's random country music playing in the woods. So there's that. You ready to go in? No. All right, so I just finished filming my um, baked potato soup recipe. I've got a poll up on Instagram right now, and baked potato soup is winning. I asked which one y'all wanted to see first, baked potato soup or this day in the life. And I think the soup is winning, so it should already be up. Make sure you check it out. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Yum, loaded baby potato soup. Y'all, I am tired. I got, um, we had baked potato soup for supper and it was so good. And I filmed it and I edited it. I hate saying that edited it um, and I uploaded it so it will go live tomorrow morning because most people voted that on my Instagram poll um, so it took quite a while to do that and then after I was done with that I was exhausted and I walked into the kitchen and it looked like a bomb had gone off yeah so had to clean the kitchen because I mean if I don't clean the kitchen it'll just be there in the morning for me to do and I, I hate getting up in the morning and having a dirty kitchen to deal with. Like, that puts me in the worst mood. So, I cleaned my kitchen. It's all clean. And I'm exhausted. I'm sitting on the bed. I'm about to go take off my makeup and probably just take a shower. Even though I took one this morning, I kind of want to take a shower and just relax and go to bed. I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. I don't know that I do it right, but I do the best that I can. Um, I'll do more in the future if you give this video a thumbs up. If it gets a lot of thumbs up, then I'll know that that's something that you enjoy. And um, until then, I'll see y'all next time. Good night, y'all.